Hello friends, in this quick tutorial I'm going to show you how to rent a view in a floor plan. In Revit you can rent your model in a view, in a section or even in a 3D isometric or in an elevation. But in this tutorial we're going to focus on orienting the view on a floor plan, the first floor plan to be specific. Go to the default 3D view. You need to be in a 3D view to do this command. I'm going to advise you to rename the 3D, the default 3D view because if you don't rename it, when you after you perform this command, the new rented view always open when you click the default, the default 3D view. 99% of the time you don't want that to happen. So to locate the default 3D view you see the 3D is in a crawly bracket. Anytime that you see a 3D in a crawly bracket, that means it's the default 3D view. I'm going to right click this view and select duplicate, duplicate with details. Now I have duplicated the 3D view. I'm going to rename the duplicate by right clicking and select rename. So I renamed the copy 3D view to 3D oriented at first floor because we want to orient this view on the first floor. Press enter. Now on the view cube, right click the view cube and hover the mouse cursor. In this first dialog box, in this first window, you have three options. Orient to view, orient to direction and orient to plan. I'm going to select orient to view. In the next dialog box, you have four options. You orient to floor plan, elevation, section, and 3D view. I'm going to select floor plan. When you select floor plan, this will bring all the floor plan, the structural plan, all the plans that you have in, the, in your project. So I'm going to select the first floor plan. Now I'm really doing, doing the calculation on the background. When it's complete, you see the view is now oriented in the first floor. But you cannot see it clearly because you're looking at it at the top. To get the right orientation, you either hold your shift key and the middle mouse button to orbit, or go to the view cube and click one of these vertex. This will give you a clear understanding. You can also orbit as you orbit a normal view. To see, if you want to see more of the model, select the section box and click on the control handle. I need to see the ground floor. You see, you can also use the control handle to adjust the size, either move away to see more of the landscape object or move close to the building to see less of it. You can also move past the fence and see. You can also use this dialog box if you want to see the internal part of the model. For instance, if I want to see the step in real 3D, I can move this to the stairwell. That way I can see the stairs inside of the building. Alright friends, if this tutorial is useful to you, please like and share it to your friend. If you want to watch more tutorials on my channel, please subscribe. Thanks very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next class. Goodbye.